It's time for baseball. This is the biggest villain in baseball. Who's the biggest asshole in America's favorite pastime? Let's find out. It is difficult to find a single talent evaluator who doesn't <laughs> quote genuinely dislike Bryce Harper. Wait, is he According hitting people? One scout, it is difficult to find a single talent Oh, the pitchers are hitting him. Damn. Who quote genuinely dislike Bryce Harper. Another scout said he was a bad person. A team executive <laughs> called him a quote, selfish losing player. Bryce Harper has won two MVPs, two silver sluggers, made six all-star teams, while still somehow being voted the most overrated player by players four times. That's Since copium. 2012, there isn't a single this guy is unworldly talented. He has Harper. to be. He's been intentionally hit by pitchers multiple times. <laughs> <laughs> gotten in verbal altercations with fans multiple times. Are you allowed to do that? Are you allowed to just hit a guy? Like, obviously, it can happen as an accident if you're a pitcher and they get a base. Are you allowed to just throw the ball and, like, fuck you? You're not, you're getting one base from me. No, but yes. I, okay, let's say, let's say every time Sammy Sosa or Mark McGuire or somebody comes up, rather than letting them get a home run, because they're going to get a home run, you just beam them with the fucking ball. Is that legal? I guess you would just walk them out <laughs> and then not cause physical injury. What the fuck is wrong with me? Bro, not so a psycho. Violent, it I took a test. He's I been took a test. Lazy, I'm not a psycho. And overrated. Unfortunately for him, a lot of these people still hate him. <laughs> he was the most publicized prospect in baseball history while also perhaps being the cockiest. And he had Dude, he looks like a be baby. So. Bryce Harper was on the cover of Sports Illustrated and literally called baseball's chosen one. Looks like and a the child, craziest part dude. about this is that on the way to the photo shoot, he crashed his car and was almost arrested because Bryce Harper wasn't even old enough to drive yet. Harper has been booed by pretty much every single Major League fan base, including his own. And it is not uncommon for some fans to take this taunting even further. You'll never be as good as Acuna. Ever. Even with as much hate. Dude, if I was a baseball player, I'd be kind of pissed off too. Because you're right next to the fucking people. They're literally above you like that. I'd be swinging constantly. Especially when I have bats and shit. Be chucking them like javelins. Just thoof, thoof. You could hurt a lot of people. <laughs> oh my god. Why, does, why do I always resort to violence? Why does this always happen? Hey, 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 this is about him. He's mad, not me. I'm using a hypothetical. If I was a mad person, which I'm not. Over 2,000 people came to the team's first game. Two security guards guarded the team's dugout the entire season to prevent fans from running in, and his college baseball card oh my God. sold for over $12,000. That year, a woman tricked him into giving her his number, started following him around, and after being stalked for several days, the team had to call the cops on her. None this of these stories connect with each you. other so this is just like, like this we're not uncommon this is so much lore an opposing catcher told him to stop pimping his home runs or they would throw at his head rice harper told him quote F you i hit the ball 500 feet I can do what I want. The two <laughs> had to be separated. After making Dude, a bad honestly, throw, an opposing it sounds like everybody's trying to take this guy down. This guy sounds like a giga chad to me. Career, and a disturbingly large sense of entitlement. I mean, adding that he was a quote, uh, bad, people are taunting bad guy. him. Another report claimed it was hard to find a guy. This dude is just hungry box. It's old Hungry Box. I don't think he's new Hungry Box. When Harper arrived at his first Major League Spring training, his teammates supposedly replaced the name on his locker with B Boy, which <laughs> was probably just some friendly rookie hazing. But his minor league opponents were not as friendly. Ooh. Bryce Harper dominated the minors and quickly moved up to the majors at 19 years old, where Man. despite never playing a game, was immediately booed. Bro, people hate him in immediately? Bat, he hit By the way, th he's on the Nationals. That last guy we watched the video on was also on the Nationals. What the fuck? What's up with this team? What's going on in Washington? In his second week in the majors, Bryce Harper got so pissed, he slammed his bat against the dugout. It oh, ricocheted God. and hit him in the eye. He was bleeding out of his face what? at the dugout. It ricocheted and hit him in the eye. Oh, it hit him. I thought they said it hit somebody else in the eye. I was going to say, that's assault, brother. In 2013, he ran full speed <laughs> face first into a wall oh. in Dodger Stadium. He was oh. bleeding from his neck, had to get 11 oh. stitches, but apparently tried to stay in the game. Oh, God. It, it's not as soft as it looks. I was laughing because I thought it was soft. It looks like it's soft, you guys. It's like cushion. Oh! Oh!
It's an LCD. A cushy LCD. They can make those, I think. Cole Hamels nailed him with a 93 mile per hour fastball. Oh! In the inning, Bryce Harper stole home when Hamels tried to pick off a runner at first. You could steal home? How do you steal? Does the ball have to go wild? Later in the inning, Bryce Harper stole home when. Oh, when so, okay, when they're checking, when they're doing a heat check. Ah, okay. So it's a Giga Chad move. That's what it is. Pitcher has to be bad. Ah, got it. Yeah, it's a scrub killer. No idea what stealing home means. So in baseball, you could steal a base, which means that as the pitcher throws, you can run to the next one. It's generally not a good idea because you'll usually get caught. The thing is, stealing home is insane because the pitcher's throwing it home anyway. Don't explaining me. I'm trying to help Chad. You, pitcher's throwing it home anyway. So, like, you're just running into the ball here. He was ejected just for throwing his helmet after a close play. That was a how dare you throw your helmet at my feet. I'm the umpire, and you're out of this game. The next year, he was upset he was well, called out on a check swing. The umpire was upset that he got upset and told him to go back to the dugout. He did, but threw his helmet while doing it and was thrown out again. Bro, the keep your helmet on. Feet away Put a chin strap on. To cover the home plate in dirt. I forgot about that. For not getting in the batter's box Send the dirt, bro. While the umpire was arguing with his manager can't throw him out for that all these fans came here to watch Bryce Harper play and you're gonna throw him out because he's not in the box this might have been the order wait what quick enough I'm out for that all these fans came here to watch Bryce Harper play and you're gonna <laughs> bro if I'm an umpire I'm seeing how many people I could get away with throwing out of the game I'm gonna make it a one-on-one -on -one. I ever if I'm an umpire every match I call is gonna be a one-on-one -on -one, a true test of skill you got one pitcher and one batter it's the home run derby every inning you're out <laughs> <laughs> I love that that's like a universal signal too to like get the fuck out of my game I love that he once even got ejected for arguing after swinging and missing saying after the game <laughs> he was just too fired up from listening to it was Logic lag bro the rapper he's been ejected <laughs> the game he was just too fired up from listening to Logic and Chance the Rapper bro Logic and Chance the Rapper this dude's amped on the wife guy I love my future wife too one day I'm gonna find her. First, I gotta hit this ball. Ooh, I love my wife. <laughs> In 2016, Danny Espinosa struck out on this pitch. He began arguing with the umpire, but then the umpire proceeded to throw out Bryce Harper, who was in the dugout, apparently arguing even more. The next <laughs> hit a walk Got hit by the splash damage. That's pretty good. The umpire even once threatened Bryce Drew Harper aggro. while he was playing center field. Okay, guys. In case you don't know baseball, where do you think center field is? Do you know where center field is? It's him. <laughs> it's this guy. He's yelling at that guy 500 feet away. Why? I don't know. Saying that he was now making an effort to no longer get ejected from games. Character Five development. Five days later, he got ejected for arguing balls and strikes. Never mind. In 2012, a Toronto reporter asked him if he would take advantage of the lower drinking age and have a beer after the game. Harper was 19 and doesn't drink, so he responded by saying... Bro, that's that's a clown question, bro. This response... He's right! ...became his slogan and was even said by a senator. I don't want to answer that question. That's a clown question, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Harper hit a home run I'm stealing that. I like and that. Apparently stared at the ball too long. It's a clown the next question. Tehran drilled him with a 94 mile per hour fastball. Harper oh, that's immediately fucked up. retaliated by screaming at him, and the bench is cleared. And if Braves fans already didn't hate him enough, the next year, while getting booed in Atlanta, he dragged his cleat over the Braves logo every time he went <laughs> to the plate. I mean, he just does. Dude, I, this guy, he doesn't seem so bad. I don't know. I'm not getting, I'm, I'm getting a pretty good opinion of this guy. It seems like all the times he's lashing out is because he's being treated unfairly or because this weird boys club is like, no, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta fall for the hazing. You gotta play by our rules. You gotta do all this bullshit. Fuck off. What the shit? Is that really like if you stare at the Pat ball for too long, the pitcher's going to hit you every time? The interview. That's Four fucked up. Later, Bro, I'm a Harper fan now. I like this guy. If everyone hates this guy, is he not a problem? No, I, I agree. But I also hate old people, and old people seem to be the culprit of a lot of this bullshit. In baseball, for the second you need year to in respect a row. He was also now the, the most feared hitter in the league. Let him hit However, you with the ball. There was one That's how we play. Who wasn't a he hit another bomb off Strickland, who got mad at Harper for standing in the box too long. Okay, I kind of do understand why people hate him now. He has this habit, because that's like an H-box pop-off after every hit.
Like, you're so popping Jordan off every like time. I see that. After every stock, yeah. <laughs> it's a home run, man. Yeah, I guess so. But, like, you gotta act like you've been there, right? I get what you're saying, but... Ooh! They punched each other in the face, and all hell broke Jeez! I think it is very unwise to have a mascot with a mouth like a carnival game. I'd put the ball right in that motherfucker. Psychopath? No! I've just played a lot of Big Bertha. <laughs> Feed her another one! You guys ever seen Big Bertha, bro? That is nightmarish. Yeah, it's pretty fucked up. Do you think we're gonna have boomer start. radio After talk shows twice, for like esports in the future? By his own fans or is it just podcast game ever as a Philly? Later that month, he would get booed even more, and even though he had an OPS close to 900, said, quote, I'd boo me too. That month, he was also <laughs> publicly criticized by a... Said, what is he... I'd what is this? Is this for covering your, your face? I actually don't know what this is. Is a guard? Does everybody have this? No. <laughs> Only he gets one? <laughs> it's optional. If I was him, I would take it too. No way I'm turning this down. I'm getting hit after every ball. If I was wearing this, though, I would watch the ball go into fucking space. I'd hit the ball and just hit the... <laughs> what are you gonna do? Hit me? Get the fuck out of here. I'm guarded from head to toe. That month, Harper also had a confrontational return to Washington, who now seemed to hate him. In his first at-bat, he was booed and struck out. In his second at-bat, he was booed again Jeez. and struck out again. Then Harper hit a double in the fifth, an RBI hit in the sixth, and in the eighth, hit an absolute bomb, pulled up a massive bat oh, he's flip, looking. and also oh, celebrated he's looking. with Phillies fans in right field. While playing <laughs> in Chicago, Harper caught the third out. He turned to throw the ball to a fan, then saw several Cubs fans giving him the middle finger, and he proceeded <laughs> to throw the ball out of the stadium. Giants fans absolutely tormented Harper, and he made them pay multiple times after being that rules. overrated by a fan. I love Bryce Harper. Harper hit a homer, turned around, and pointed at him. Dude, every player has done this. Every professional player. I've done this in Smash when I was good. This happens to everybody. I, I've been Bryce Harper. That's my fucking guy. Every good player has done this. Season. Earlier that year in April, Harper took a 97 <laughs> mile per hour fastball directly to the face. Ooh. And as scary as this oh! Oh my was, god! And as Holy shit! And that's why he wears the gu that's the what the point of the mask is. Oh my god. It was basically god. a miracle there was no broken bones or a concussion and Harper played 4 days later. How is In he reality, fine? It was way more serious than anybody knew. The pitch injured his wrist more than his face, but also uh, because okay. he needed time off to get over the fear the pitch to the face caused. Oh According my God, to his GM, yeah, dude. That's nobody knew up. what Harper, Harper himself got extremely emotional when it came up in an interview after the season. But as scary as this was, when Harper returned two weeks later, despite not even being an all star, put up second half numbers so dominant, he came out of nowhere. And I love won this his fucking guy. MVP award. Harper has solidified himself. This is my favorite player. Working. Did I tell you? guys the story of uh i've told some people the story but we have a lot more people in chat now i've been hit by uh an errant baseball once uh i got hit hard i wasn't playing i was watching i was at a minor league game with my uh girlfriend at the time and her family okay and i'm eating something and i'm looking away because baseball is kind of fucking boring sometimes let's imagine i'm sitting right there in this spot right here imagine that you're me okay i'm looking away the guy nails a line drive like pounds that shit and it comes directly over to me there's no net and lands right here in the center of my chest it landed in the center of my chest and it rolled up so it was like Phew. and and i'm holding something i forget what i was holding maybe it was like a hot dog or something but i went like my arms went out I was like Phew. my girlfriend at the time i swear to god this is 100 percent true laughed she laughed because I made a funny sound and my arms went like this. Not a joke. Oh my god, hey, Stan's viewers. Hey guys, I'm talking about a, uh, a, a story. I got a story from an old girlfriend of mine that made me not trust women for at least 10 years. <laughs> Would you guys like to hear one? I know we've all got some of those women, am I right? Hold on, okay, so this fucking guy comes up to hit the ball this motherfucker nails me with a line drive right here. 
dead center of the chest. Boom. My arms go out like this. And I think it's like that, like a bird. Kind of silly, right? And my head goes out like that. Her reaction is to laugh at me. Don't, I can't. It wasn't funny. I could have died. If it was inches to the left, my heart would have stopped. And you never would be enjoying this content tonight. But you know what, though? It didn't really hurt. And I wasn't as mad at my girlfriend as I was at the lady who pretended she didn't get the ball. This happened, too. The ball hit me in the chest, rolled up, flew behind me, and it flew back like 30 feet. And so I'm like, hey, uh, you know, I got hit by the ball. I, I think I should keep that ball. It sounds funny. A bunch of people saw where it went, and they saw the lady that got it. I went up to confront her, and I'm like, hey, can I have that ball? I was the guy that got hit down there. Can you do anything? She's like, I don't have it. Lady. Come on. Now I double don't trust women, you know? <laughs> This was an older woman, so you can't even just say it's just teenage girls. This was like a middle-aged lady. Weird way to come out. Guys, this is all to say I have something very important to announce to all of you. <laughs> all right. It's enough baseball posting, but thank you for making this. Guys, this is from a channel called Baseball Doesn't Exist. They upload every once in a while. We've watched a bunch of their stuff. Please subscribe.